Wedding bells are ringing at the Minetta Lane Theater. We're standing on ceremony. The Gay Marriage Plays is making its world premiere. We're here to talk to several of the contributing playwrights and actors to find out more. Standing on Ceremony is a group of plays by a variety of wonderful writers, all centering on the topic of gay marriage and the legalization of gay marriage, the emotional content of any marriage, the, the challenge of, of both the political struggle and the personal struggle. It's an evening that, that has a great deal of humor, has a great deal of surprise, many surprises, uh, because it's not the way that you expect this subject matter to be addressed. I was attracted by the cause first and then the illustrious writers. It's pretty great to know you're going to be doing brilliant stuff every night. I wrote a play called London Mosquitoes and the play is about a 70 year old man who has been together uh, with his lover for 50 years and uh, they have to really ask the question, should we get married? What happens when you're asked to conform to a pre-existing format of what marriage looks, feels, and sounds like? The one that I just performed tonight, today, this afternoon, was about a, um, a gay son and his mother, and they have a really close relationship. <laughs> and she's so excited that um, they passed gay marriage in New York that she has him getting married already. And he's like, I don't even have a boyfriend yet. What are you talking about? All of them are funny. Uh, uh, some of them are funny and touching at the same time. There's a lot of meaning in it. And, and, but it's people working through relationships and deciding what they want or what they're after and, and a coming together of couples sometimes or uh, an expression of what marriage has meant or would mean to these people. I think it's a treat for the audience because it becomes a kind of tasting menu and if they don't care for one piece there'll be another along in 30 seconds. So it's a, it's a great opportunity. I think it's something you only get in the theater, that feeling of of an embarrassment of riches. I hope that audiences will come to see it not just because they're predisposed and already support the idea of gay marriage, but because they have complicated feelings about it and want to see those feelings addressed. The evening becomes almost a town hall in which the audience is very involved in the event. There's a sense of give and take of, okay, here's the widest possible range of opinions on this topic. How do you feel? Are a lot of these themes universal to all marriages or is this just a show for gay audiences? Well, I think that, that you know, whenever you deal with the specificity of, of, of marital problems, you, you invariably end up making a play that is for everyone. Behind all the politics, there's a, a human heart beating in the plays, and I, I think there is. I think it's uh, as much about uh, falling in love and, and consecrating that and uh, being part of the continuum of the human experience. I think they'll be unexpectedly moved, they'll be riotously amused, and hopefully, uh, given to think about uh, love in their own life. People do join in the spirit of what it's about and, and uh, bring their best selves to the evening. And so that's, that's the best thing about it.